wait. Oh my god. Oh my god, what is this? Pretty easy. Paper was over the head. Or how am I gonna do this with my eyes shut? Where's the end? Whoa. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna to be doing the no mirror makeup challenge, but instead of doing just that, I'm going to be closing my eyes throughout the whole of this as well, just because I have got a viewfinder just there and I do not want to cheat. I wanna see if I can create something without looking. It's probably gonna go really wrong, but we're gonna try anyway. Without further ado, let's just jump straight on into the video. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Don't forget to hit that red subscribe button just down there and click that notification bell to be notified whenever I upload. And let's just get on into the video. Okay, so I just need to try and think. I need to try and think of a way of how I'm going to do this. So I've got everything set out in front of me. I'm just going to grab obviously the thing that I need and then just close my eyes and apply it <laughs> so i'm going to start off with foundation so I have the la girl pro coverage foundation in the shade fair <laughs> i'm gonna go ahead and put that on with my iconic brush so oh, okay the thing is i could keep going all day with this because i literally don't know <laughs> how much i've done like Oh my god, I'm gonna have like an orange hairline. That is it for foundation. <sighs> okay, not too bad. Okay, so moving on to concealer. So I'm just gonna take my Jouer concealer. This is the high coverage one and this is in snow. I'm gonna go ahead and wait. So I'm just gonna go in with my fingers and blend that in. Put that on my eyelids as well, just to prime them. All right, okay. <laughs> I look so pale. You can see that was a lot more difficult than I thought it was gonna be. I think it's because it was so white. Okay, so the next thing that I'm gonna go in with is probably gonna be my contour. Balm Bahama Mama Contour. And I'm just gonna take a little fluffy brush and close my eyes when I swirl it because <laughs> Yeah, it make it a bit more fun, I guess, so. Like, I'm literally just trying to do it for memory, like. <laughs> but I have no idea where this is going. And then let's do a bit on my nose. That is not too bad. Okay. <laughs> right, okay, then next is blush. So I have the Max and More blush, which is from Home Bargains and Poundland. So this is in the shade Rose. Yep, okay, so this is gonna be a tricky one because obviously you need to use the tiniest bit of blush because it's so pigmented. Just make sure we get like enough on the entire part of the brush, but just not a, not a lot. So I don't know. Oh my god, I have no idea like how pigmented this is gonna be. Okay. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Wow. I knew blush would do me over. Oh, why does that look so white there? Oh my God, what is this? 
Okay, right, okay. The next thing that I'm going to take is highlighter, and this shouldn't be too hard either. This should be pretty easy. So the next one that I have, this really, like, dirty palette. So this is the Sleek Makeup Solstice Highlighter Palette. Highlighting. I always say highlighter, and then it just instantly reminds me of, like, the little highlighting pens. Right, so, oh, I don't know what one to pick. Let's take the pink one, this one, yeah, let's take the pink one and see what, see what happens. I don't know, I keep tipping my head back. Okay. Like, I don't even know where my bloody cheekbones are when I've got my eyes open. Shiny. Whoa. <laughs> that is a interesting shape that's made my face look. I mean it's not is it? Is it bad? It's not overly bad. I genuinely just think it is that blush. I think that's literally doing me over today. The next thing that I'm gonna take. <sighs> what am I doing next? Brows or eyeshadow? Um I'm really scared to do my brow. I'm gonna to have to do my brows, aren't I? Okay, so this is the Wet and Wild Retractable Brow Pencil. Um, yep. Yeah. <laughs> How am I gonna do this? I'm like trying to think. Well, I'm just have to go in and do it, and I. Right. Okay. So you've got three points to your brow. So I usually start about here. Open as well that I can just brush through this with the spoolie. Oh my god, this this could go. This could go anyway. I really don't know. What is that? Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, oh my god. <laughs> Poke myself in the head. Where is it? Yeah, brows are a lot more difficult. Done. That one actually looks all right, you know. Wow. <laughs> that one actually looks all right. But I'm pretty impressed with that, actually. I'm pretty shocked with that. I'm going to... Uh, Give myself a little pat on the back for that one. And then the next thing that I'm going to do is my eyes. And I don't know what I'm going to do, to be honest with you. I've got the Primark Glitter Junkie Palette. So it's just got these beautiful shades in. I don't know why I picked this palette. Why did I pick this palette? I don't know. I really don't know. What am I going to do? I'm going to take this, like, corally pinky shade. So I'm going to attempt to put this in my crease. Right, okay. Oh! I don't even know if it's picking up on camera though. Look at that blush. Oh my god. Okay, and then... What do I go for? I might go, I don't know why I'm doing this. But I'm gonna go in with this green one. I don't know why, I just think it looks really nice. Oh my God, right, okay. So I'm just gonna take this on my lid and then I'm hoping that I can, where's my lid? I'm hoping that I can just blend it up to so like, just slightly like airbrush it out a little bit so it's not too patchy. Oh, Okay, I'm then just gonna not look in. I'm gonna try and blend that out. <laughs> okay. Wow, that green is really contrasting with that pink blush. 
Wow. <sighs> I'm gonna then go into this pink one right here just to deepen up the crease a little bit. And yeah, okay. <laughs> See if we can cover this eyebrow disaster as well on this side. Right, okay, that looks a little bit better. But then, next I'm gonna do mascara. How am I gonna do this with my eye shut? I don't know, but this is the Sunkissed Mega Bold Mascara and I'm just gonna try and put mascara on with my eyes closed. I don't know, how, how do I do that? Okay, that's not too bad to be fair. She's gonna, oh god. Just coat them for the fake lashes, which I am gonna do with my eyes closed, obviously. But I have no idea if it's even gonna work. Oh my god. Right, lashes on. So these are my fave lashes that I always say I have no idea where these are from. Um, so I'm just gonna take these ones just here and pop some glue on. Wait, do I do that with my eyes closed? <laughs> That's too hard. But I have no idea how I'm supposed to do this. Like, how am I actually supposed to know if it's straight? That is the middle. Oh my god. I kind of feel like where the end is. Oh my god. No way. No. Where's the end? I feel like they're going a little bit tacky now, it's just kind of making it a little bit easier. My face, I bet my face looks an absolute picture. Oh my god. Oh, that's not bad to be fair. Oh my goodness. Oh no, actually. Right, <laughs> just right and stick that down. Okay. I mean, that is not bad. I think it's just because they need to be pushed up slightly, or this one has actually been put a little bit lower than this one but not bad to be fair seeing as I couldn't actually see and I can't even put my lashes on at the best of times when I can actually see so maybe we're on to something here it's not that bad take away the blusher it's not that bad to be fair moving on I think this is the last step as well oh no I might actually before we go on to the last step I'm going to just take <clears throat> I'm going to take the pink and just run that along my lower lash line, I think. The faces you pull, man, when you're doing your makeup. And I can't even see, like, what I'm doing. Uh, I actually look bizarre right now. Like, making no eye contact with you whatsoever. Okay, done. Oh. Oh, what's happened there? Oh. <laughs> right, okay, now last but not least. So I've got the Revolution Pro. My hands are covered though. Look at the state of them. <laughs> right, so yeah, I've got the Revolution Pro uh, lip pigment in Veil. So I'm just gonna put this on with my eyes closed. Right. Okay, so that is the last thing. That is literally all of the makeup. So all in all, I really don't think that I did that bad, to be honest with you, like not to blow my own trumpet, but 
I would probably wear this look. <laughs> I'd probably go out like this 100%, apart from the blush. So, oh yeah, obviously the blush is crazy. Um, I don't think I actually really blended my foundation in. Um, under the eyes looking a bit weird. The eyeshadow is not fully blended. We've got a lot of more pigment up here than we do here. I mean, the, I'm super impressed with the eyelashes though, and this eyebrow is looking on point. Um, highlight is not too bad, but you can see here, look at the state of my hands because of this. Oh my God. But yeah, you can kind of see like the blush where it's, I've obviously gone a little bit too high, but the highlight is kind of in the right place. I literally do not think that's that bad. Like obviously there's areas that I could have, you know, if I was doing it properly, I would obviously blend it out. Oh my God. Do you know what, that was actually loads of fun. I didn't even realise, I thought it was going to be super stressy. Like, I was going to have no idea what I was doing at all. But it's actually alright. Like, if you have any, like, other suggestions or anything that you would want me to do next, or if you have any challenges that you've seen that you would want me to do, literally pop it down in the comments, like, and I will happily do that because things like this are absolutely hilarious. And the fact that it's, like, not even turned out that bad. I mean, I might look back at this while I'm editing and be like, Oh, yeah, but in the viewfinder, it actually doesn't look that bad. I mean, I haven't looked in the mirror though. See, maybe I'll look in the mirror now, actually. No, that's not a mirror. <laughs> that's not bad. Oh my goodness. Even in real life, like the blush is in the right place. It's just, oh. It's just a little bit too pigmented than what I would usually go for. I'd obviously blend it out or go in with a foundation brush. But yeah, I'm actually impressed with that. <laughs> but yeah, so that is the end of this video. I really, really hope that you enjoyed it. I hope that you're having a lovely day. And don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Don't forget to hit that red subscribe button. Click that notification bell to be notified whenever I upload. And I will see you all in my next one. I'm